one, they just kind of want to run in and play some crazy Dota here. Yeah. So, Blind's been drawn out in the mid lane. I'm not sure what they're going to get done, but perhaps a bit of a group up here for SMG. Ninja Boogie top. actually going to TP top because there is some trouble here for mid one. Can you save the day though? Not quite. Mid one is going to drop still raging. We'll turn around and try to go onto Tino and they might find a decent trade for themselves. Tino still taking through the damage. He's going to drop the arena, but does eventually go down. The arena not going to mean too much now as Bob will be forced to just orb himself out of there. But Moon have the burst damage with level one toss left in. Um, you know, you, your priority is still on farming as this hero in comparison to a pop who wants to run a ninja boogie. Schmack's off the mark. There's the Fiend's rip out, but they've got the Sans to make sure he can not continue. Still, the cavalry is incoming here from SMG as the relocate is out from Moon and Afu. Meanwhile, Tino, he actually got mid one. Well played, mid one has dropped still. The side of SMG rushing Palos and Vincenzo. And it's so much damage flying out from Raging Potato. Still, they will continue to try and chase them down. In fact, now Execration with the turnaround. Do take down Ninja Boogie. Raging Potato, he'll be the third target to drop the top lane as well. Everywhere's just got a little bit of action now as Ninja Boogie has tried to move in with a Nightmare. Dream Coil is out from Bob to lock down the Gyrocopter, but you're still going to lose Vincenzo. At the very least, they do get Ninja Boogie as a trade. Raging, he doesn't want to keep going. He needs to run. Shanks is here with the pushback, but a Sonic Wave is out, but it won't help. It won't help too much. It's now mid one. He's been silenced up, and there's Tino with the Arena Spear out for Moon. He's coming from the side, but is he a bit too late? It does seem like it. Execration might be able to clean up here as Moon. He is just going to try and back off here with Arthu when he does. Bot yeah. lane. Raging Potato just currently right next to Shanks. They don't know yet, but now he should see him with the Omi Missile out and the Rocket Barrage. It's a very painful experience for Shanks, who's still being chased down. Shanks takes the stun. He doesn't take any time. He's going to die to the Rocket Barrage. They do find Raging Potato, but now Tino, he's been trapped up and completely surrounded. They won't even need the stun. Moon will take him down. A 2 for one trade in the favor of SMG. Top lane as well. A relocate is coming as Ninja Boogie. He needs some help. Vincenzo still going. Ninja Ooh. though, he is not going to die. They're just trying to get farm where they can. Palace has all the room up top to get that done. And as long as the TPs come in, he should be fine. But they aren't coming in now. Palace would be a huge target, but the TP away is Ooh. not going to be there. Ninja Boogie, he's in range for the Nightmare. And... You can thank the Keen Optic for that one, John. Ninja Boogie getting a little bit lucky with that neutral item. Mid lane. Relocate back. Moon gonna try and protect our food, but the Sans was there. Our food still surviving, still alive, still running away. The tether's out of mid one. He gets a double kill with the They're Sonic. not gonna see him yet, but he does go underneath the Observer Ward now, so they know he's around there somewhere. They'll try to force the fight underneath their own vision, and in they go. Tino, he's out with the spear. It's a great target. Ninja on the bane, though. No, the nightmare does save his life, and he will survive a little bit longer. They finally take him out, but what's it gonna cost? Execration have already lost two. They do at least get the top T2 tower, but Palos has been caught out now. Mid one and raging find him, and they take him down. Nothing like a BKB to protect him. Ninja Boogie, he might die, but this will be well worth it for his life. Finding that position one tiny once again. That's really quite a nice play from the Bane now as SMG, moving up towards the top side, are even going to find Shanks, it seems, as the Split Earth is going to land and they'll find another. Ah, Fu to take that one. Monkey Dota. And they've got two guides now with Raging and Ninja Boogie. So, you know, they, they, it's working out for them so far up against Execration. Execration, I think, are getting a bit hasty, though, Mike. They've, they've got to reel it in. They've got to play a little bit safer. Just wait for the farm to come in and have faith in Tiny. Easiest kill go high ground. Top tier three tower is under siege now. They will try to delay this as much as possible, but Moon doing so much damage. Tino's gonna make the jump in, but where's your follow up? It's not there. Tino now the one in trouble, and he is gonna drop. He's got buyback. Now, maybe they could just go after this mid racks once again. I don't think Execration can actually fight this. No, could you go for Mega Creeps? Maybe they could, but Bob, he'll be moving in with the Dream Coil, trying to go after Moon with the Nightmare. Is there on the Tiny? Meanwhile, Tino does not land a spear. Moon has killed off Vincenzo. Onto Palos they go. And without that magic immunity, there is no chance of survival and no buyback either. As Ninja Boogie is somehow still alive and they get Bob. Well, not yet. Bob hanging on by a thread. Somehow still duking out. Here we go again. Bob with the great escape. Mid one, 
Wait, do you blink, sir? Oh, that's a nice blink out oh, from mid nice. one. Very nice indeed. Tips out from Ninja Boogie, and it's on to get the Megas. Nothing stopped them now. You know, all the spells have been expended. For execration and, and call the GG. SMG? I mean, they, they play as we expect SMG to, you know, this is the aggression that we were looking for from them, especially from this regional finals, it looks like with Ninja Bogey. To be fair though, Jonathan, the, usually your theories are just revolving around circles, so do not take <laughs> Johnny Spire's words seriously, he has no idea what he's talking about. This Tino is going to rush up on that Dawnbreaker, and this is one thing you can do, is get very aggressive with this hero with the Starbreaker. Ninja Boogie though does avoid the stun, but he's taking so much damage as he does get taken down for first blood. Though can Tino get up? Puts Avalanche uh, secondary to the tree grab, so you don't really have that burst to punish Tino if he overextends. And it's just a natural double slum lane. It's always pretty nice once you have that open. Here we go again. Toss is up. Mid one trying to go after Shanks. We'll cancel the start break with the Avalanche. But you've got Tino, who's still going to chase him down just a little bit longer. So he'll throw the bone out to try and take him up a little bit. But the chains are there from Raging. And now with the Chakra Magic, they should have another coming any moment. But they won't even need it. Arfu to take the kill as Tino, he came in to try and help out, but he has just been another kill to go the way of SMG. Right through Tino, he does have the raindrops to protect. They'll force more heroes to rotate down to try and help out as Bob has shown up, and now they have caught out the Ember. Raging does cop the finger from Shanks. That'll be enough to take down this position 3 Ember Spirit. Rest of SMG, it might be just time to leave. Moon, he's been chased down, but he should be just fine. Although, there is a Medusa, but the Fiend Grip is there. Moon, he will try to turn around. They have bursted down the Lena, however. They'll even find Ninja Boogie. So it looked like a decent start as Vincenzo actually dies to the neutral creeps and now raging. We'll try to go back in on Shanks. But Bob, Kino, they're looking to go forward. Mid one, a nice toss up onto Bob, but he's going after the Keeper of the Light. He could not care about this tiny as raging. He does find the Lion. He's on the run, Bob. Kill, but no. The mech does actually save Vincenzo's life. In the meantime, Ninja Boogie has been caught out and towards the south. They've even got Raging Potato trapped up here by Tino. But he'll make a run. He'll be okay. And I believe so will Ninja Boogie. So nobody dying quite yet. In fact, now Shanks dying. Mid one does come on the front lines. We'll be able to get plenty of vision here with this line of fist as he does look to back off. They have an X out onto the Ember, but again, he has another slide of fist. But no, he doesn't get it off in time. He will be able to remnant though. And they are buying enough time for Moon to just respawn up slowly. So the Roshan will not go the way. In fact, mid one, a nice toss back of the Bob oh. with the Fiend Grip through the BKB. That is a really nice play from mid one. And suddenly the Roshan looks to go for SMG now. Without the Conquer, you don't have the boat, you don't have the foreign. It's really difficult for Excretion to come into this fight. You could try to make a play with Shanks, but it's blink, but gonna try but a big stun out into Shanks who's about to drop and it looks like Raging will go right to the backside. Meanwhile Ninja Boogie does drop. That's one dead. But there goes your lion. Shanks is gone and now Palos slowly getting dwindled away here by mid one but no never mind it's the other way around. Mid one he's still trying but Tino with the star breaker does get rid of him but now Palos he's out of mana. He is still trying to man fight this one out but it's probably not gonna work out for him. Raging what? does move. Oh boy Palos by himself so he will just escape patience game is here from smg but execration they have the numbers advantage bringing more heroes up so tino is being targeted it seems this mid one is gonna run right into him who are they aiming for though it looks like they will toss in raging potato to kill off shanks there goes your lion tino though is still trying to chase down our food as vincenzo even joins the fray a complete mess of a team fight thus far but here comes the cavalry, execration, they've got the back up and they're gonna aim right in for the tiny with the Mortimus Kisses, they should have him. Mid one, he's still trying to fight, but it's not gonna be enough. Game, right? 20 to 20, 23 minutes in 2k lead for execration. It's not much, it's a dead even game almost. It looks like it could just flip on the coin flip. Shanks, he had Raging, but the 4 staff away is going to allow Raging to re-engage. So a big Mortimus kisses his out. Arfu in trouble. Does end up going down first, but the Fiend Grip now on Bob. No, he's going to let go of it. This is not the fight for SMG, but it certainly looks like the fight for Execration. As now Moon's been slowed up. We'll try to use the Shadow Amulet to juke this one out. Meanwhile, mid one, he'll go for the fight. But this Medusa is so, so tanky. They're getting through the mana eventually, but now with the Stone Gaze, they've got to run. Maybe they can turn around. 
They could try, as the buyback is there raging. He's gonna try and move in. The Medusa out of mana, but a big cookie out onto mid one. Here comes Raging Potato though. He'll keep going. Moon with the right, because they've got Palos down. And somehow mid one is still alive. But they found Ninja Boogie, but they'll lose Tino, it seems. Eventually he will tick out, but he pops his BKB still raging. Again, the real carry for SMG just continues fighting on. Has the chains out of This comes a lot simpler. We're gonna have Ags up on Raging soon, although Roche here. And Big Boat out is gonna connect on to Moon. They just blow on to No. In fact, never mind the Nightmare. It saves the day. Ninja Boogie allowing Moon a second chance at life. As Shanks now is gonna be targeted, and they do take down the Lion. It's a great Nightmare out from Ninja. They are back into the Roshan pit, but Bob is going to try and re-engage. X is out onto the Bane. He is still perfectly fine. Raging in the meantime, chaining them up, allowing the Roshan, and now SMG. They can go for the big dive out. Onto the Conquer, they'll take Bob down. Raging Potato on the front lines again. Onto Vincenzo, he'll find another. Always tanking damage, always taking spells. Now SMG with a double damage rune on Moon would really like to get started, but Moon, he is actually going to go right past them. They have those entries down. So he just sneaks right past onto the Lion. That'll be one down as Palos is going to stone gaze off on Raging. But he's perfectly fine. As Palos continues to move forward. In the meantime, Boat is going to fly out onto Arfu, but he's fine. Mid one. Oh, there's a Fiend's rip out. They've got Bob locked down, but the Solar Guardian again going to buy that space to allow the Cooker to leave. Execration. will throw out the kisses Ooh. onto Raging Potato, but he's still going to survive. Still the fight continues. Mid the X back. Big smoke though. Execration. Who are they going to find? Mid one's a great target, but he does pop the silver edge. And just trying to run, but they have the dust up. They've got the control, surely, to take down this tiny. Mid one, he's gone a bit too far this time around. That's a very it was such a long TP. Raging. Gonna keep the chase up. Nice cookie there from Vincenzo. Raging Potato's not done though. He wants that mid Kunkka and he will find the chains out. The boat will be forced for Ninja Boogie. He has the Fiend Drip with the Aghanim Scepter. There's no cancelling this one. They'll trade with the life of Bob and they want more. Raging Potato. Be a great target to go after. But he back off at the right time. Or has he? Maybe not quite, as the torrent is gonna land with the Mortimus Kisses and Moon still dropping. Here we go again, Raging. He's here. They still have the Aegis with the secondary line. The rest of the cavalry coming in, trying to get there in time to help out Moon. He's dropping real fast, though, and it doesn't seem like he'll survive through this, though he's still going. Moon still trying to go for the man fight, but Tino, he's got the Solar Guardian, and they want more. Bob, he's out onto Ninja Boogie. Mid one, though, gonna rush in. Vincenzo and Shanks, they've been deleted. Palos is not dropping low, but everybody else around him is, as now Palos is out of mana once again and it seems like SMG somehow are looking to turn this team fight as here comes Raging Potato into the backside they've got the Fiend Grip Palos is completely out of mana now and he's easy pickings for this Ember Spirit as mid one and Raging they get to work and they completely wipe them out Bob's the only one left and not for long John he's gone God. It's in his name, Raging Potato. What do you expect? Him to be calm? No, Mike. Mike. He goes crazy. He's angry, John. He's a very angry vegetable as Vincenzo is going to drop. Chains out. Palos, how do you defend this? He's got no heroes around him. And they realize it. Still makes the jump in. Palos, he's been completely ignored. They're just going right after the Ancient. Raging's the only one that wants the Medusa kill. Oh and they will finish God. off the game. SMG 2-0, the sign of execution.